am back again. Seems that my videos had more success than I expected. I had a lot of replies about it and several questions always came back. Now to answer those questions I'm going to make uh, more videos and explain situation by situation. One was uh, the question, okay, uh, there are certain plans, uh, people are talking about calculations and stuff like that. If you are really not an engineer, you have no ability to make calculations, are you able to make a safe plane using the plans? Okay, from the three plans I know of, uh, I can give you the next data. Uh, one, the HM14 has the plans in the book. And you can build it like it is mentioned in the book. Only thing is, the rear wing is rotating. Uh, because in that plan they didn't use an autostable airfoil. Now the modern versions of the HM14 are using modern autostable airfoils. Now they don't have that moving uh, rear wing. There are a few other changes being made in the evolution of the uh, airplane. Uh, remember the plans date from 36. Now it's a bit later. Uh, so it's normal that evolution goes. Uh, I will try to find the data of the differences and place them also in this video. The HM293, I have the plans all here. Um, get the plan, build it, it's safe. It uses a NASA and NACA airfoil and uh, no trouble about it, uh, you have it in French and you have the plans in English. The HM 360, 380 plans are also available recently in English. Now, um, I consider them as really the best plans you can get at this moment because everything in text is being reviewed, rephrased if needed. Um, and it was especially made for the USA market. So if you are from non-French speaking area, consider them as uh, one of the best plans you can get. Uh, Paul Pontois uh, translated the plans and you can get them through him. Hope you like them.